so we are going to discuss about radial gradients in our last class we have discussed about how we can repeat the linear gradients but today's topic is radial gradients go to your code editor and this is just the output of this code as you can see here so i'm just going to write uh, instead of this linear just radial and you can just save this for right now go to your web page and now you can see we have something just looking like circle but this is not a circle you can see uh, if you want to just make it a perfect circle you need to just use here before the red you need to insert a comma and here circle save and refresh now you can see it is just in circle more so by default it is on ellipse mode e double l i p s e i p you can save and refresh now you can see it is on ellipse mode and you can just put this on circle circle and you can see now this is a circle and you cannot use here something like uh, you can say square or anything else save refresh you can see this not working so you cannot use this here because it has two attribute circle or ellipse i'm just going to save this once again and you can see it is just like this so you can just increase or the decrease the just amount of this color for example for red for yellow for blue just you can set the percentage here for i'm i'm just saying for the red i want just five percent and for this one i want just uh, 15 percent and for this one for the blue i want just 13 percent you can save and now you can see for the red we have five for the yellow we have just 15 and for the blue we have just the rest of this is just for blue you can just increase or decrease you can say just 25 for this one or you can just say 50 for this one and you can say just 30 for this one save now come here and refresh you can see this is just another uh, you can say circle style or radial gradient style that we have just created here so like this you can just increase or decrease just put this on 60 percent save and refresh now you can see and you can just put this on the 10 percent save now you can see and you can just uh, increase or decrease just put this on the 55 and this one just on the 80 and save once again now you can see we have just increased the size so we are just going to make this on 20 this one just on 40 and this one on just again on 20 percent save and refresh so this is called radial gradients and for radial gradients we can use here circle and we can use here ellipse you can just remember this and refresh so this is called ellipse and you can see circle save and refresh so this is called circle and i hope you are understand and also you have enjoyed watching this video so like always please do practice have a nice time and see you